What's up, everybody? Richard back today with another video. And actually, right after this is uploaded, I'm going to be live over on my Twitch, twitch.tv slash Richard Jambrin, where I'll be doing a full album reaction to the new Ice Nine Kills record, Welcome to Horwood. But now, we have Knocked Loose's new EP, Six Tracks. They just released it. Six Tracks, no singles, nothing. Just here you go. Here's Six Tracks. We're, got, we're, we're clocking in at over 21 minutes. And uh, this is going to be a good time. This is one video. And uh, for, for those of you who have never watched me grade a full EP or an album before, what I do is I grade each track, and then I add them up together and divide them by the number of tracks. So in this case, six. Anyway, we have an animated film. This is exciting. This is really cool stuff. I've heard a lot of great things about this EP, and I'm excited to finally check it out. So here we go. Knocked Loose, A Tear in the Fabric of Life. First track is where the light divides the holler. Here we go. Flashing images, okay. Let's get comfy here. Let's get comfy. Okay, all right. A tear in the fabric of life. Will Putney, the goat. Oh, this is cool. All right, here we go. Turn this all up. Let's All right, so we'll pause there uh, just for the first track. So where the light divides the holler. Man, I'm giving this one a nine. I absolutely love this. This was relentlessly heavy. I love that build up there in this section there with like the, and then you kind of have like the drop with the a tear in the fabric of life. I, did, I love that kind of stuff, man. Super creative stuff. 
very uh the, the guitars here kind of reminded me a little bit of like a fit for an autopsy i know that we're working with will putney that is obviously um you know gonna be infused in some way shape or form because you know he's you know in the band but uh no man that was super super heavy um just the drops the breakdowns uh this is off to a hell of a start but now we have the next track which is god knows all right transition. This track here. We'll pause the radio right though. All right, God, God knows, man. I mean, whew, that was just nonstop heaviness, man. They the, the, that um that first transition there was absolutely fantastic. Um, I love the vocals in this. I mean, Brian's vocals, I know, are definitely a point of contention with people, but um, I think he's fantastic. And then I don't know if he was kind of doing like that black metal, like, you know, that kind of vocal or whatever. But if he was, that was really cool to hear. And I love this. Uh, I love the, the like the outros or intros that bands, you know, have done, or now in this case, Not Loose is doing, where you kind of have like clips of like these other, you know, kind of old school songs that kind of accentuate the heaviness of the tracks because of how, you know, calm and, and, um, you know, just chill the tracks are. So for me, man, I think I give God knows, I mean, even like a 9.5. I, I love that, man. 
But now we got forced to stay next. Let's see what this is all about. This is gonna pop off. in there, okay. Is that some, like, tremolo picking going on? Oh. Got telephone wires for strings on that guitar, bro. All right, so that was forced to stay. Yeah, man. I mean, this track here, once again, knocked loose and heavy go hand in hand all the time, and they did not uh, disappoint with that here. This track was very ominous, kind of kind of eerie, especially at the end there. The -da 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 -da. Um, clearly building towards this next track, which I'm very curious to see where it goes. Um, I, I this EP so far has been uh, very very. It's been like a really cool story because uh, you can tell that each track is kind of building to a, a new mood uh, that reflects the story that we have on hand here. So I think that's really, really cool. And, um, yeah, man, I, I, th I mean, these guys are three for three with me so far. I, I'm going to give this one probably about a nine. I mean, this this is this is absolutely stellar stuff. So next up, we got Contorted in the Fail. All right, here we go. Or the Faye. I, I don't know. F-I-F-A-I-L-L-E. -I Faye. Oh. Oh, this 
kind of reminds me of something. Oh man, we were Give me chills on the right side of my body. Holy smokes. These guys are masters of transitioning, man, to different tempos. Holy shit. See what I mean? Holy smokes, man. We'll stop it right there. Contorted in the, I don't know if it's fail or fi I know you, when you get those, when you get that LLE at the end, you know, with the, with the I LLE at the end, you know, kind of messes me up. But I'm giving this one a 10. This is my favorite track. I have never been more um, like just, I mean, that track was destructive, man. I mean, I've never been more consumed by heaviness than this track here. I mean, this was absolutely phenomenal. The masters at transitioning to different and slower and faster tempos. The hits there at the end. I mean, I got goosebumps up by the right side of my body. I don't know why it was the right side. I thought I was having a stroke. But, I mean, that's what happens with these kind of tracks. So this one gets a 10 for me. Absolutely fantastic. Now we have Return to Passion, which is just over a minute. So I'm curious if this is kind of like an interlude. Or, I don't know, with Knock to Loose, I mean, it's very possible that we could have, like, a minute-long track. So, here we go. This is, probably the heavy, if this is an interlude, or meant to be one, heaviest interlude of all time. I 
love the vocal pattern there. Hold on, there's some ASMR stuff there at the end, boys. Um, Return to Passion. Uh, yeah, the ASMR stuff, man. I, I don't know how it affects you guys, but it makes my head tingle like crazy, and that was what's happening there. But anyway, Return to Passion, one minute ass beater of a track. I mean, you'll never, I'll never give these less than a nine. You know, I just love, I love me a good ass beater. Well, you know, for, for songs, you know, really. Not, 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 not. Okay, let's move on. Permanent. This song is close to five minutes long, huh? Dude, if his vocals don't get you charged up, I don't know what does. Holy shit.
All right, so that was permanent. And, of course, you know, a little bit of a longer outro, but it made sense artistically for, for the story that they had here. Man, I, I, I'm giving this one probably about a 9 to 5. I mean, this, I mean, listen, I just... This is, I love this stuff, man. I love Knocked Loose's style. And, in, and especially in this EP, they were just relentlessly heavy. Uh, Brian's vocals throughout were phenomenal. I mean, I know that people, you know... You know, call him Mickey Mouse or whatever kind of bullshit you want to spout up. But that dude there has a voice that can just get you revved up and ready to go. No questions asked. Uh, instrumentally, man, this stuff was heavy as balls. I mean, like this, this this was relentlessly heavy. Some some cool eerie stuff, especially like in um, Force to Stay, I believe was the track. But overall, man, I mean, this was just 20 minutes or so of just straight up just... I mean, carnage. I mean, this was this was crazy stuff. Oh, wow. I mean, this is probably, I don't know. I loved a different shade of blue, but I, I like in terms of in terms of a piece of work, I would say this is probably my favorite piece of work. You know, as a collective art form that Not Loose has put together, the video with it. Now, this is something that I almost kind of want to go back and watch the video, even muted just so that way I can focus on the storyline because I was trying to, but I mean, the music was just so goddamn heavy that it was kind of difficult for me to, but yeah, let me, uh, let me pull up the calculator here and, uh, let's, um, let's, uh, see what knocked loose has here. So we have a nine, 9.5, nine, 10, nine, 9.25. Divide that by 60. Not about a 93%. Yeah, man. I mean, this was just absolutely recklessly phenomenal. I mean, well done. Let's give him a round of applause. Yeah. But anyways, guys, come check me out over on Twitch right after this. Uh, you've watched this. Twitch.tv slash Richard Jamron. Ice Nine Kills album reaction. Um, and then also my social media, my like I said, the Twitch is down there, and then the Patreon, as well as the link to this phenomenal animated film uh, by Knocked Loose. But, uh, yeah, man, Knocked Loose, a tear in the fabric of life, 93%, phenomenal stuff. Till the next one, peace.